If your lift is not working properly and clicking or beeping, start by checking your connections. Unplug the handset cable and actuator cable from the control box. Reinsert the cables into the control box using the palm of your hand. These are watertight connections and can be stubborn. Now, try operating your lift. If your lift is still not working, check the battery and control box terminals for any corrosion. If needed, you can clean terminals with an alcohol wipe or a cotton swab with alcohol. If your lift is still making clicking noises, please contact customer service. Likely, your control box or actuator will need to be replaced. If your lift is making a beeping noise, this could indicate a low battery. Start by checking the voltage on your battery and charger. To check the charger, make sure the charger is plugged in. Using your voltmeter, place the prongs on the charger terminals. A good charger will read around 27 volts or more. If your charger reads below 27 volts, it needs to be replaced. If your charger has proper voltage and your lift still doesn't work, you will need to check the battery voltage. Remove the battery from your lift. Using a voltmeter or a multimeter, place the prongs on the two battery terminal tabs. A fully charged battery should read 25 volts or more. If your battery voltage is less than 25 volts, place the battery on the charger and then check it again after 24 hours. If your battery is still beeping, it may not be holding a charge. Contact customer service to order a replacement.